In the last video, we talked about the Firebird. The hero performs a sacred ritual, ascending to the upper world. I would like to continue the topic. Let's take another myth and decipher by the same method. In this myth, the conversation is again about a flying vehicle, the golden skin of a winged ram, the result of a sacrifice to Zeus. Heroes are not one, there are many of them. Jason, Hercules, Orpheus, etc. This is a collective image. Ghoul travel climb the social ladder to the very top. Mythological symbol Golden Fleece. The golden skin of a winged animal associated with Zeus. Flying carpet from 1001 Nights, pebbled leather, go on and on. The unconscious of all peoples has drawn many such images. I think you get the point. The same is in the myth of the fiery bird. Secret knowledge that contributes to the rise on the pyramid of power. Let's move on to training. The initiation procedure is dangerous, the hero must pass the test. Show skill in practice. This is the educational system in ancient Georgia. The first is the economic base. This is the foundation. The future ruler must harness the fire-breathing bulls and plow the land. In principle, any serious business can be described with these images. Fire-breathing animals are forces in society. They must be used so that the hero can rule. The method is trick. Any popular wisdom has a proverb like the Georgian one. The saw is better than the effort if the man invents it. The hero throws a stone of discord at a group of aggressive warriors. Divide and rule. The hero passes the test for power, relying on thought, intention, design. This is the etymology of the word Medea. Sublime meditations, a mysterious potion, all this gives the hero the opportunity, to the final test, to defeat the dragon. Again, the hero's entire journey, takes place in an introspective world. The sea is the perfect image for this. The next stop, the next stage, is cleansing from the sin of murder. Anyone familiar with the mythology of the Gita, can remember that there is also a conversation about gaining power. A formula for liberation from the karmic consequences of murders is given. You need to see what is common in the world's masterpieces of mythology. Let us recall that it is the Caucasus that is indicated in another Greek myth, as the place where Prometheus is chained, keeping the secret of the power of Zeus himself, which he is trying to find out from him in vain. Apparently, Eastern and Western thought, meeting on the territory of my homeland, created a special interweaving, appreciated by other peoples. Indirectly, this is indicated by the fact that medicine is also connected with the topic of our conversation. I will not go into details, you cannot concentrate on particulars. Myths should not be viewed as newspaper articles with accurate chronology and historical characters. Cultures will become closer to each other, seeking commonality in mythology. The mythological language is one of the means of communication between different peoples of our planet. Only by looking for something in common in each other's culture will we be able to realize ourselves as heirs of the wealth, collected in the common treasury of mankind.